temperatures, there's one unlikely item you may want to take out of your car. Water bottles. Yeah, believe it or not, the cool, refreshing drink could lead to a fire if the conditions are just right. WFMZ's Will Lewis has that story. During the summer, many keep a bottle of water to cool off. But be careful where you put that water in your car because it could turn it from a refreshing drink to a fire hazard. It's a mistake I'll never make again. 69 News meteorologist Drew Anderson says for him it was a normal day. When I come up to the station, I always put my big water bottle right in my passenger seat. One day on a really hot and humid day just like today, I left it in my car. A hot and humid day where the sun was shining through the windshield at just the right angle onto something flammable in the car with a temperature hot enough for a fire. Similar to taking a magnifying glass and holding it in the sun as a kid. And because that beam of light was so intense on that one spot on my seat, it actually made the seat hot enough in that area to catch on fire. You can see the hole in Drew's seat, a charred mark on his water bottle, and burn marks on the edge of the fabric. 50 things that would start a fire in my car, water <laughs> bottle would not be one of them. People hearing about the story are shocked, and firefighters we spoke with say it's rare, but a real thing. My family and friends, they they, they always have water bottles in the car. It just happens this was the perfect formula. In Drew's case, it's probably a good thing the sun was setting, so the angle of the sun changed. Videos on the internet show other cars being destroyed, and Drew knows his experience could have been much worse. Leaving something like an everyday item like your water bottle in the car, and then your car catches on fire because of that? Crazy. Will Lewis, 69 News.